B2B Savage, the Japanese catch that. I believe he uh, was made his untimely demise right after he was on a Vlad TV interview. I'm not saying Vlad had anything to do with him getting killed, but you know, Vlad has a bad track record right now of you know people on his on his interviews, and then you know something bad happens to whether it's jail or uh, robbery or something or you know. So how do you how do you feel about that situation? Man? Shout out that boy Vlad. But I think Vlad, he for the culture, mm -hmm. but he not in the culture. You see what I'm saying? Uh -huh. So we just like... What do you mean by that? For the viewers who might not understand what you meant. He don't know. I don't think he completely understand how we living. So he could have edited some of that video out with B2B Savage. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Because it's consequences. d boy spinning. Right. You feel what I'm saying? And it don't matter. They spinning from 14 years old to 40. See what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Rest in peace to B2B Savage, for sure. You know what I'm saying? My prayers go out to his family and all that. But I believe Vlad knew it was gonna blow up because it's a it's a it's a murder, a a, a self defense murder. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So shout out shout out to uh shout out to Vlad. I know he's trying to get his money, but it's consequences when you get on this camera and talk too much. You see what I'm saying? That's real. That's Cause real. folks really living like that in the culture. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? I don't think he really understand that. You know what I'm saying? He might be for the culture. You know what I'm saying? He break a lot of news for the culture. So shout out to Vlad. You know what I'm saying? Right. But I would say this too. I I feel like part is on him, but part is on the people who uh, he interviews. Because one of my favorite interviews by him was uh, Pee Wee Longway. For sure. He asked Pee Wee Longway a lot of incriminating stuff, and Pee Wee every time he answered it perfect. For sure. And ain't nothing happened to him because of he... And, and, I, and I agree with that. So I, I take it like it's 50-50. Part of it is Vlad's fault. And then shout out to people long way too. Because he, cause when you get in that seat, Vlad seat, sometimes you're going to be a hill detective. Oh, he yeah. sit there and he's going to question. Oh, yeah. Especially if you got something going on. You see oh, what yeah. I'm saying? You in the streets and you For sure. this and For that. For sure. So, you know. So you got to be mindful. It's 50-50. You know what I'm saying? But Vlad should understand that. It's consequences behind stuff like that. Like another instance, you got Hurricane Chris. Mm -hmm. He was in the same situation, like B2B Savage. You know what I'm saying? Uh, self defense murder. So shout out to uh, Hurricane he Chris. He, he beat actually, it. He tried to do the right thing. He man. beat it, but he he went and sent condolences, and he was humble about it on camera. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So I mean, it, it both of them. You you got the. You just got to understand. You know what I'm saying? But, man, shout out to everybody who falling or whatever Righteous. from all this. You know what I'm saying? Everybody family. Straight up, man. Because I'm, I'm I'm about positivity. Righteous. For sure. Most definitely. Another um, thing that's been trending as far as uh, crimes or snitching, uh, allegedly, with Gunner and the situation with Young Thug. Earlier... Young Thug had a link posted on his Instagram page that was a link to Gunner's album. I'm not sure if it's an old album or if it's a new album, uh, but there was a link there. For sure. And you look up again and it's been removed. So, I'm not sure what happened, who controls that, but what do you feel about that? Uh, I ain't gonna say too much, but I wanna say two things. First thing, Free Thugger. Free that boy Thugger, man. He's staying solid down that solid down that thing. You see what I'm saying? So for sure, free that boy. Free Thug. Second thing I wanna say, Gunner still is part of YSL. So I, he still gotta make money off of him. I'm guessing he's still part of YSL. You feel what I'm saying? I ain't heard now. I ain't heard nothing different. So I'm, I'm guessing he's he still, still part of still business wise. I'm so not sure so I mean he told YSL was a game though. I don't know, man. <laughs> yes, ma'am. That man, yes, ma'am, man. <laughs> yeah. Ooski. Yeah, that, that was a tough one. That Damn, Gunner. One. I rock with Gunner too. Gunner with that dude. Gunner with that crazy. dude, man. I think that. He, he know how to rough. lace a track. Go ahead. He what does. you say? He gonna have a rough at first, but he make the right song. Everybody gonna forget him. Man, you crazy. 
If, if anybody anybody like me listen to it, man, nobody trying to hear that. You gonna be I ain't, uh, uh I ain't me personally. Other same. people might though. Other Rick people Ross, might. They did the but same people thing like me, man, nobody. Rock. If you ain't living what you rap, man, I ain't trying to hear. That's ninety percent of these rappers. Nah. Though. Not the young niggas, but the niggas who old. I don't know though, the fam. Young niggas, they living that shit. They living it. They living what they crazy. rap. Or the old ones, like you said, they used to live it. You feel what I'm saying? I mean, man, listen. If you ain't living what you rap, I ain't trying to hear. I ain't. I ain't trying to hear. I ain't even. I ain't finna hold you. I agree. That's why uh, it's certain rappers I don't listen to now. And I'll go on and say their name. They make good music, but I can't take them serious. And I'm going to say the first one. And I caught this, but I was young. But I was like, y'all didn't hear what he just said? Rick Ross. The first song he made, that mofo got on there and said, I know Noriega, the real Noriega. He owe me a hundred favors. And I said, hold up. If you know Noriega, one of the biggest crime bosses ever to uh, the Kingpins, whatever, in the history of crime, of crime and drugs, he owes you a hundred favors. <laughs> <laughs> I said, we just gonna let this man say that. Man, shout out that boy Rick Ross, man. Hey, question that. Hey, hey, you wild, my boy. Shout out that boy Rick Ross, man. Hey, he made it past. I ain't had. I ain't had a, <laughs> he, you he, he had a long successful career after him saying that. Nobody from where, where but Rick Rock make good music, so I see he what do. you saying. Nobody, even after the cop thing, people was mad. You know, he was a security like, guard. But either way, you know, folks was. I don't know, man. He dropped his album, another mixtape. It was crazy after that. He ain't had no more fuss. But I don't that. think that wrong with being a security guard. Only He's thing not, I think he, he got lied. a lot of backlash from. He lied. He lied. That that didn't keep that thing one k. You feel what I'm saying? But you know, you think he lost some fans after that? Nah, cause you don't he, dropped, think so? he dropped the best music of his life after that. Yeah, for sure. He, his career went up after that, so that's why so I feel like the same thing. If Gunner dropped the right song and the right people co-sign, if he gets another song with Baby on it, they drop it. Yeah, get another song with who? The Baby. Or okay, you think like Baby? Drake or you you like do that. think Baby or Drake finna jump on them? That what he messed up. Ain't nobody finna know. jump on those features, you man. Never know. I know who gonna jump on. Ooh. Six nine. <laughs> Ain't nobody jumping on that, man. Ain't nobody jeopardizing they brand for the man. Listen, all that clown jump, man. Ain't nobody, hey, man, man. No, ain't nobody finna jump on that, man. So you tell me if the future jump on the song right now, bro. Future ain't gonna do that though. He got a brand. I ain't he got even, Boston Richie. He jumped on the track after that. And <laughs> Boston Richie didn't drop 30 songs. My boy going hard in the paint. Hey, hey, Boston Richie drop. I follow that boy Boston Boston Richie on Instagram. Hey. Real talk. I never unfollow him on that, but he been working. You see what I'm saying? But I ain't nobody. He ain't got no features hey. yet. Boston From Richie my man. knowledge, he ain't got no feature, but he going in. He going in. Boston he going Richie. in. He trying to save that career. He See what I'm that saying? Y'all ain't got no other pictures in there? <laughs> <laughs> they call that boy Boston Snitch. Oh my God. Man, but shout out to Boston Richie because I don't know everything about your case either, so. You know what I'm no saying? Other in there? But <laughs> I just, I'm just standing from afar. You see what I'm saying? If you a rapper right now. And they came and said, we got you 150 racks for a feature. For Gunner. You're not going to do it? No. Mm. Hell no. If, 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 no, why? If, if, if somebody wouldn't pay me 150 racks, that mean I'm, I'm lit. So why I need you? You see what I'm saying? I'm not finna, I'm yeah. not finna, you done blew your own candle out, my boy. You stay 10 toes on what you believe in. <laughs> I'm going to stay 10 toes on what I believe in. You see what I'm saying? I predict gonna have another hit record. You predict gun? I don't and know. Folks, and folks, all the reasons six be nine is head. part of a different culture. That's why I still think he be able to to survive. Ah, uh, gonna I think over oh, we. Only thing that could say gonna. Only thing. I mean, the only thing could make that man say gonna. You know what it is? Young thug. Young thug, young thug. He need yeah, young thug to with vouch that. to say, look, man, I told him to do that. I agree with that.